There's been a lot of controversy over requiring vaccination status to be presented in order to let someone into your business or entity. And the bill by Representative Larry Bagley would make it a crime to do so. The bill would create a $1,000 fine for anyone who asks someone for their COVID-19 vaccination status in order to allow them into their business. Representative Bagley, who said he did get two shots, says it limits people who choose not to get vaccinated. Uh, I don't believe anybody has a right to put a needle in my arm and put medicine in there if I don't want it. Right away, members had a problem with the bill, even after it was amended to remove jail time as a punishment. Despite how they feel about vaccines, they found an issue with forcing businesses to be subject to a crime. I don't want to impose any of uh, our laws on a private business owner if they want to put up a sign that say you have to be vaccinated to come into their facility. Many of the members of the House Criminal Justice Committee say that they're against vaccine mandates, but feel this bill is not the best way to go about undoing or preventing them. The, the appropriate way to do this would be to prohibit the government or any governmental entity from enforcing these kind of things. Lawmakers also pointed out that the language of the bill would make it a crime to simply inquire about if someone is vaccinated, which they say is not discrimination. After only short debate between the representatives Representatives Bagley decided to voluntarily defer his bill to work on it to potentially bring it back another day. At the Capitol for your local election headquarters, I'm Shannon Hecht.